Hey everyone, welcome to the Winter Festival playlist of series 22. First of all, I'm gonna show you the Forzaton challenges, what to do, and also the cards that I use for the championships. Hopefully they will help you win everything you want. So let's have a look at the Forzaton shop. Here you can see the Bone Shaker that is actually banned from online adventure. Uh, it doesn't steer, but it's fast, so it's basically a very OP car. Then we have some skirts for the ladies and we have a Renault Sports Clio. So what do we need to do for the Forza Tom? First of all, we need the Land Rover of 1972. Then we need to do 20 racket skills. We need to win a cross country series at Ambleside. And we need to drive 15 miles. Now that's very easy. I'm already in my uh, Land Rover. So what do you need to do? 20 racket skills and I'll show you also the cross country. Now here is the cross country. First I didn't see that we had to go there. I didn't read it right. So this is the one here uh, on the left side of the map. Now to do the racket skills first you of course just rack these thingies um, till you have those that pop up of the Fortaton. Then we go to this one. We enter the event, take solo, custom event, and then you here you have the easy Forzaton. If you don't follow me, you will see the code right here. You can give in the code and you will easily find my blueprint. It's just driving straight for 1.0 kilometers. Then what else do we need to do in the Forzaton? We need to drive 15 miles or 24 kilometers and that's basically it. That's for the Phototon. It was a very easy one, so it doesn't really matter this one. Now let's go to the trial. I'll go to my map. I'll just put everything off and only that. So here, what do we need? A B700. It's Evo vs Impreza. We had that before, so that's nothing new. Now, what's the car that I use? Um, the car that I use for that is actually the Subaru. Now there's a Subaru that is ac actually the best one. It's this one, but it's a rare car. So not everybody has that. So I'm not using that one, but if you have it, you can use it. I used the 2005 Impreza. I had no problems winning uh, in the trail. And also you will win the car, the 2004 of this model. Now the 2005 I will be using in another championship also. Then next one is playgrounds. Now this is a little bit of a tricky one because you do not have a lot of cars for that. Playgrounds is actually extreme off-road C600. You basically have three cars. So let's go to D and C class extreme off-road. There you go. So basically you only have three cars. I don't know if everybody has the regalia type D. Um, it's sitting in the other regalia in the perk points. So basically you only have three cars to choose out. I tried this one. I found it a little bit slow. So I took the Toyota and actually it was way better than this one. So I recommend you taking that one. Um, and we actually win this one. The regalia out of it. Then let's go to the next one. Mud is thicker than water. We need a B700 modern rally. Well, I said in the trial, I'll be using the same car again. So that will be, of course, the Subaru. Let's go to the Subaru, the 2005. No, not this one. This one. So basically, you can use that car in the trial and in this championship. Now, what do we win from that? That is the new Mitsubishi. I'll show that at the end on the video, the two new cars that we can win. So let's go to the next one. Here have off-road rampage. That's very easy. A800 off-road. I always take the same car and never have problems winning anything. And that's so simple to use this car. It is the 2017 Ford Raptor, not an S1, but in the 8 class. 
What do we win from that? We win a Land Rover Series 3 Forza Edition. Then let's go to the Gold Commute. We need Daily Drivers A800. Now you got several cars for that, but the car that I use for that is actually this one. The nice Mercedes A45 AMG. Also didn't have a problem to win it. Um, very easy car, very grippy, very good in handling. So I just took that car. It's a car that has already been tuned in previous seasons, but it does the trick. Now the car that we want from that is a BMW M6 Forza Edition. Very nice car to drift with. Um, I really like that car, so that's good. Then let's go to the PR stunts. I'll show it to you on the map. There you go. Now let's go to one of this one for example. This is a fast one. You need uh, 400 something, I can't remember it. You just start here, that should be enough. Well, I'm surely not gonna do it with my Land Rover. So what I'm gonna take is, you have the, if you have the Ferrari, just use it in X-Class, the tune is shared and it has snow tires on it. You can also use the muzzle for it. So basically avoid traffic and go for it. I didn't hit any traffic. I probably will hit traffic since I'm recording. As you know, it's always something goes wrong in my PR stunts, but that's okay. It's a very sunny day today. There you go. That's way more than enough for this PR stunt. Then let's go to, no, there was something in the city here. This is also a very easy one and I'll show you why. And you're gonna say, oh, Fallacy, you're such a noob. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's like 30 degrees here and I'm very hot. So I didn't really bother. So what can you do? Yeah, something I always try not to do. If you can't get it, just wall ride it. Ooh, there you go. And you get it very easily. Then another one, a little bit an annoying one, the jump here. You can see here you have the corner, just go here. Now I tried several cars, um, I can't do it really with the Ferrari because it's a little bit bumpy. Now everybody should have the Hoonigan RS200. I actually took my S2 car for that. Now there's also a RS200, the normal version, you can also take that in S2. So I'll show you what to do. Now normally you should um, break the fences first. Just go a little bit off. Well, normally you should start a little bit further and break these fences before you begin. But you can see the Hoonigan is very stable in that. You can easily do it with the Hoonigan in S2. So, if you don't have it, you can use the normal uh, Ford RS200. So let's have a look at what we win. So here at 50% we got a total new car, the Toyota Celica 92, 80% the Jeep Wrangler DD, the body design. And here in one of these three, of course I can't see it anymore, I think it was, I can't remember, um, we got that new uh, Mitsubishi. So let's have a look at the new cars. First of all, the Toyota. The new Toyota Celica 1992. This is the new car of 50%. There you go. Well, funny thing is, I owned a car like that, but with the uh, trunk, not like this, a little other model. Pretty good car, 1600, 
high RPMs that engine just doesn't break so this is a new car at 50% And now I'll go to the next car since it's getting dark. That is the Mitsubishi. And that's this one, the Starion. There you go. This is the new car that we win in the Muck is thicker than water. Mud is thicker than water. As you can see, an old timer looks pretty cool. I always like old timers, so we need to test and tune this car out to see what it has. It comes into C class. That's it for today. I'll be streaming tonight to help you guys out if you need help for the trial, for the championships, and just tune in to have fun. And we can just do everything from the festival playlist and have fun. So hopefully I'll see you tonight on my Twitch on the live stream. Okay, bye bye.